How's it going, everyone? Um, I just fi I have recently finished Uncharted: Drake's Fortune for the PlayStation 3, and um, I must say it's a pretty good game. I finished the first one before I even bought the first one. Um, I just bought it going off reviews, and I ended up loving that game. So uh, late last year, I thought I might might as well try out the first one, seeing as though the third one will be coming out this year, so I tried the first one and finished it. I didn't like it quite as much as I liked the second one, but um, yeah, it was pretty good in its own right. Um, it took me about 10 to 12 hours to complete. Um, it's my third PlayStation, no, my third game that I finished in 2011, and my 24th PlayStation 3 game finished overall. And I have a total of 530 trophies now. So just a few impressions of it. Um, the story is interesting, and the campaign is fun. Um, they're the mm, that's pretty much the big thing about this. It's just a fun um, game overall with lots of variety. Um, it has intense gun gunfights and it, and um, terrific voice acting. The graphics are pretty good and smooth, um, especially for was it four years ago now, oh, into its fourth year. This game will be, I believe, and um, yeah, it has it has puzzles, it has climbing, like adventure, um, and it also has obviously the gunfights because it is an action game, and. Um, the puzzles are a little lackluster, um, but that's not really much of a complaint because it's an action adventure game, not a puzzle game. Um, the it has great pacing too. It might mix up a a gunfight um, after you finish with a gunfight. It will throw you in a um, a puzzle. Then you might have to do some climbing and then you know find your way around a castle or something like that. It's set in the jungle on a Lost Island, and uh, yeah, it's pretty good. Um, the store, the ending's really great too. I'm sure most of you have finished it, as it's a pretty old game. Well, not that old, but um, came out a couple of years ago. So um, yeah, the ending was spoiled to me um, before, but um, yeah, it's definitely <laughs> interesting. Um, I'm not going to spoil it for those of you who haven't played it, but um, the game is a bit on the short side. It's roughly 9, 10, maybe 11 hours long for the average gamer, maybe shorter if you're an expert. Um, and the campaign is the only thing in this game. Um, there is no multiplayer or co-op or anything like that. There are harder difficulties, but um, in my opinion, the campaign is so engaging that um, it, the game doesn't require any additional game modes or content to be a nice small package. There are like collectibles and obviously there's trophies for people that want to go through the game again. Um, but yeah, the the campaign is definitely great quality and um, I'd give it an 8 out of 10. So um, yeah, it's a it's a great game. Um, a lot of you may think that because it didn't get a 9, it's not great. But um, in my opinion, it was great. Um, so yeah, 8 out of 10. Um, that's about it for this video blog. So yeah, I'll see you guys next time.